anti-terrorism to the Islamic law. You know, we had, you know, we had uh, Asif and Suleiman, they accused me, I mean, with Asif as an example, he said, boy, what is Israel, the dates? And they said, oh, that's hate speech, but, but, but it's not from Islam. You know, they called um, the, the, the police on him. I mean, I, I, I sort of sometimes question, are they Muslim or what side are they on? Because those are the accusations that are being made against our speakers and removed them. You know, it, it seems like they're fighting from the other side. So I think I just want to keep in mind that this is not just a simple case of the, we should get somebody else for this last week. We've got people who are really dishonest uh, and are doing very, working almost against the Muslim community. And secondly, look, it's not easy to stop the Muslim community. It's a, it's a very important platform. You can do a lot of good, but you can also do a lot of, lot of bad from that platform. So I think I would just like you all, as, as, as a fellow to say, is that just to support the protest. And if you can't come on the Friday, you know, every Friday, and, you know, whenever you can, but also on the social media, you know, try and um, sort of raise the awareness of all the issues that we can, we, we can sort of give you all the facts and the issues, the issues that happen both on the sister side and, and the male side. Um, and, and let's individually sort of you know, communicate that message to all our groups. Because I think one of us sending 100 messages has far less impact than 100 people sending one or two messages because it reaches a far wider audience and has a far greater impact. So I think, you know, if you haven't got time on Fridays, to try and raise awareness that way. Yes, because I think one thing that the Palestinian Paris, the issue reminds you of, but to stand up what's right. They've been standing up and, and facing their own 75 years, and they've got far, far bigger issues on them. Ours are nothing compared to this, but they've still stood there. They have given up. They didn't say after a few months, you know, I'll forget about it. You know, <laughs> leave Israel to us one time. They did it. They're still fighting now. You know, and our cause is much smaller, but in the grand scheme of things, this is where, you know, our, our children's lives and the community's lives are going to be shaped by the, the local side. You know, that's, that's where you can do the good. I got it. One last thing. I think we've forgotten what Muslims can be like. I think that's also something that, well, historically, all that are now is somewhere to pray. That's really not all what Muslims were meant to be. Muslims were meant to be the YYTs because, I mean, I, I remember saying to Omar that the fact that you open this sector, you need to open this sector, is a sign of our failures as well. Because the Muslims, apart from the, the daily prayers and, and Ramadan and Kabul Eid, the, the, the halls are all empty. You know, they, that's, that's something that can be used for the youth. You know, it's empty throughout the day. That is what the SM youth can use um, without having to pay enormous costs to hire them. You know, so I think we should remind ourselves that the most is meant to be a hub of the community. It's meant to be sort of you know, bringing the youth, the elders, everyone together to learn together, to have them congregate together. And, and you know, you're right. You know, it wasn't meant to be just for five days. It's you know, If you look at the, 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 the town of Brooks, Everything happened there. You know, it, it wasn't just for friends. There was nothing that did to the scale of the measure that is now. You know, so I think, I think it's, and what I want to say is that it's, it's something that we really need to fight for. It's not something we can just walk away from. There's nothing you can face very easily. So I'm just urging you to sort of support in any way you can um, on the Fridays with your presence or if you can on social media, really, awareness.